we can tell by looking at this neighborhood that this may be a residential neighborhood. So, Jimmy, what's something when you look at this landscape that tells you it's a residential neighborhood? Sidewalks. Sidewalks, good. What are, why are sidewalks part of a residential neighborhood? So people can walk and stuff and be safe from cars. Okay, are there, are there landscapes where you wouldn't see sidewalks? Uh, that's a lot of questions. Uh, farms? Good, yeah, you wouldn't see sidewalks on farms. What is something else, Annette, that, that you see here on this landscape that would make you think it's a residential neighborhood? Oh, there's stairs going up to the front steps. The houses are nice and decorated. It's like people take pride in their neighborhood here. Good, good, yeah. So you can see that, that people take pride that they live here. Yes, Alex. Residents, residential, residents. Exactly. So what, what's the connection there? Houses. I see houses. Yep, houses. But some people live in them. They're residents, right? Anna, what about you? What do you see in this neighborhood that might make you think that this is a residential? Right? Sue, what about you? What in this landscape is distinctive? Garbage cans, yeah, and what would the garbage cans tell us, Sean? Uh, that it's Monday, and Monday's garbage day here. Right. Because I live here, I know it's Monday's garbage day. All right, Madison, is garbage day in your neighborhood on Monday, too? No, it's on Wednesday. On Wednesday? Okay, what about your neighborhood, Anna? What day is garbage day in your neighborhood? All right, Jen, what about you? So why do you think they have different garbage bags? Because there's so many residences. Oh, yeah, good point, good point. You have to have a schedule. All right, so class is going to end in a few minutes. I want you to get your homework out from yesterday. Make sure your name is on it, all right, and then pass it up to me, okay? Pass it up to the person in front of you. Okay. All right, so class is almost over. The bell's going to ring. Um, Anna, can I get you stages for a couple of minutes? All right. Ring. Thank Have a good day. Thank you. Thank you, Miss See you tomorrow, Miss Cooper. Yep, bye-bye. Have a good day. So I'm kind of concerned about you, Anna, because usually, you know, you're very conscientious about turning your work in. But lately, you seem very distracted, and um, you're not turning in your assignments. This is the third assignment this week you haven't completed. Is there anything going on that you'd like to share? How's everything at home? How's everything at school? So how are you feeling? Okay. Anything bothering you? So why do you think there's been this big change that from you usually being so participatory in class and turning everything in and suddenly you're not, that it's kind of concerning. Why? What's going on? Why is that happening, do you think? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what's wrong. Is there something wrong? Can you say more about that? How do you mean you don't feel great? Like physically or mentally or what? I don't know. I don't really know what's wrong. Do you know Miss Overhue? No. She's a school social worker and I think I'd like to take you down to talk to her. Is that okay? All right. Come on. Let's go. Let's grab your things. We'll go see Miss Overhue.